We got the tractor out here today doing the heavy work because we're not about to sit here and play games with this. So we got the gravel right here. This is um, half inch lemon pepper uh, gravel. And we're just gonna stick it right on in here. Woo! Gotta go change my boots real quick. Get out of these shoes and get into some boots. It's time for the heavy duty work. Carlos over here chipping away, building the side gorge for the floating raft unit. And when you come right here, we've already built the frame, done some of the groundwork, just building out the side panels for it, and then we're going to go ahead and lay the, um, the liner inside of that right afterwards. Alright, so one mistake that we end up making is we cut this a little bit too high, but we realized it right before that it's supposed to go fit right in here, so we have to cut about an uh, inch and a half off in order to get it to squeeze right in here. So make sure you don't make that mistake. It might cost you an end. Boom, we got the liner in. Carlos over there finishing up, getting ready to put the water in here. Test it out, get it nice and secure before we continue securing it all the way on all the edges. Bam. All right, let me come over here, grab this water, get the heck out of my way, all this stuff. Let me see if this will fit. Will this fit? Boom. Uh, I don't know. Maybe it will, maybe it won't. Let's see, this is not going to be long enough. Uh, boom, 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 boom. Oh yeah, yep, I can get it to fit. Let me cut this off real quick. Come over here to the well. Boom, cut this off real quick. All right. We're very moving. All right, take that off. All right. Get ready to turn this water on. All right, let me know. You ready to turn it on? All right. Check it out. Let's check it out. Let's check it out. Boom, boom, boom. Boom. Inch cap. Let me see. Where's the inch cap at? Uh, I need this. I need this. I need this. I need this. No, I do not need that. Quick. Right. I was like, wait a minute, you're not young in the dead? Yeah, he ain't gonna believe it. He ain't gonna believe it. No, he ain't gonna wanna believe it. But yeah, they should stop by all. So what y'all doing in there again? Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Farming. Let me tell you about farming. Yeah, I was gonna tell him. I never forgot. He used to make fun of me. <laughs> <laughs> you over there making fun of me? Oh, you trying to farm, huh? <laughs> <laughs> That's what it is. You said like, just like that. Just like that, man. Oh, you over there trying to farm? <laughs> <laughs> you over there trying to farm, huh? So yeah, man, I'm doing my farming thing, man. He said I was prior, prior to him. Like, he always used to come over there poking his little jokes, man. He always said that. You moved it here, now you moved away over there. He said, if you skin that grass back, it's going to be rocks, pebbles, <laughs> 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 He said, it's, 
There's gonna be gravel all underneath that. <laughs> you said you skim that. <laughs> you skim that grass back. Because he's out of gravel. <laughs> you didn't have to go nowhere. You could have skim that grass back. <laughs> That's what you said coming before. Six weeks. Six weeks is up. Next week is up. Next week, tear it down. Six weeks. Oh, oh snap. Six, yeah, he was right too. Six weeks. Yeah, he said six weeks. Keep it up. We'll be tearing it down. Move it over there. Six weeks. Six weeks. Oh, keep it up. One week, tear it down. Move it over there. That's what like, and then when he turned out, he was like, see? Yeah, he, he said, yeah, he said, yeah. And there he goes again. Yeah, and then yeah. he's about to try shit for a whole nother yeah, one. Yeah, he always said that. He with it. Yeah, he always said that, man. Every time I like to tear, tear it down. And I'd be like, man, this is the last one. I'm, this is the final one. And then um, six weeks later, <laughs> tear it down. Bring it back up again. Yeah, build another one back up again. Another day, another day. All right. Got out on time today. Now it's time for us to get out here and do some plumbing. Today is plumbing day, so I'm pumped about that. That means that we're pretty much almost done with the whole system now. It's coming together, I'll give you a little update, boom. So we got everything set up. We gotta do a little bit more building here on the floating raft, but then we just gotta plumb the unit and then run it, man, and that'll be it. But the thing is with the plumbing, we can never overestimate it, or underestimate it, excuse me. You can never underestimate the plumbing. This looks simple, a few things connected together, but for some reason, just the way it is, it's always something that comes up that causes the, the, the project to be prolonged. So we'll see if that happens. Everything's been running smoothly, so we'll see if everything continues to run that way, and um, we'll keep you updated. Which one you want me to start with first? Let me lay the work down real fast. Stop one first? Yep. Okay. Going in a little bit, going in a little bit out of time, alright? Yeah. Okay. You ready? Yep. Let's stop. Let me know when you're ready. Let's go. Bottom? Bottom. Yeah, a little more. Huh? A little more. Did he go in? Yeah. Okay. All right. Can you put any piping on it? was a nice little workout, huh? Can you put any piping on it? Yeah, we're going to put the piping on it um, once I lift it up, or once we lift it back up. You want to stick it stick it on there right now? We can do it when we, yeah, let's lift it up and get it uh, level, and then we'll stick it on there. Ready? All right, tell me if he's... Oh, that one, yep, that one went in. Easy. That's too far in. Yeah. Is it? Yeah. Okay. Right, and right there is good about an inch in. Okay. Looking good, looking good, man. What we got here? Bam. 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 What's this man about to do? This man really about to get him a ride, man. <laughs> this dude, I love this line. Can you just fit that thing, man? You ran out of gas. Oh, it's time for me to ride. You out of gas? He's not kidding. He out of gas. He done ran out of gas for real. As soon as you get over there, gas is out of there. I mean, it ain't meant, it doesn't mean it ain't meant to be, man. I'm gonna get Ryan that thing before I fly back. He came back for you, Carlos. Carlos, he came back for you, man. Oh, yeah? Go get it, man. Go ahead, don't worry about it. He said he ain't got all day to wait, man. He said, get in there, man. He ain't got all day to wait. <laughs> he said, what?
What happened? Let me try real quick, man. Oh, <laughs> you want to get up? Yeah, here? we supposed to be working, man. We supposed to be out here on no go karts. Oh! 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 Man! Okay, that's it for me, man. Oh, that's what's up, man. I appreciate you, little man. Cool, yeah, yeah. You're Give me some. Driver. Give me some. Good stuff, man. I appreciate it, man. You keep up, man. You're going to do good in life. Oh, hold, hold on. Keep on. Give me a One, two, three. Man, my back is absolutely killing me right now. Not from just doing this, but from the long amount of hours we've been working to get this done. A lot of standing, a lot of bending, a lot of kneeling. Oh man, just finished putting in the rest of the beads for the bead filter. And this, for the, those of you guys out there that don't know, this is a bead filter. It does both the biological uh, filtration and solids filtration. So it's a two-in-one component. And it, in my opinion, the best filter for aquaponics, um, serious aquaponic growing um, on the market. So. I'm pumped to get ready to put this together with this system and um, get it going. So, just finished putting in the beads in there, and those are what have this is what's going to house the biological um, or the nitrifying bacteria, and this is where a lot of the, um, the biological activity is going to take place, also along with the filtration. So, boom. Oh man, about to sit down and eat some of this nasty Panda Express. Boom. But right now, we're on the go, man. So, Gotta do what you gotta do, man. So eat real quick, man. Get some fast, quick food, and then um, jump right back to it, man. We're trying to finish up. We got one day left. Not even one day. Pretty much half a day. Tomorrow, Carlos leaves, so we need to have everything done, or at least 95% of it done, because I know we're probably not gonna get every single small detail. Because I can see already that there's gonna be a few things that need to be adjusted um, once he leaves. But I'll do it my own. Do it out on my own uh, time. So about to get ready to chow down. Boom, one more time, man. And uh, we'll be back. Man, it's about 10 p.m. And right now, I gotta get ready to go make a quick stop at Walmart to go and get some silicone. We're having a problem right now with the bottom drain. This thing is killing. The bottom drain continues to leak. I mean, we tried, we've been working at this thing probably for about at least two and a half hours. And the bottom drain should not be giving this much problem, but for some reason, it's not seating correctly. I mean, we've tried different bolts, bolts with washers, bolts with nuts. I mean, all type of things, man, putting different adhesive on there. So we're gonna go ahead and just go crazy with the silicone. It's like small little leaks, little pockets that, are, um, that have uh, accumulated and are causing the water to leak out. So, you know, gotta go up and Walmart's probably about 15, 20 miles away, somewhere between then. So, you know, it's country life, so live kind of far from everything, but at least it's open 24 hours. So we can go ahead and knock this out and um, see what this does. I'm optimistic. I believe that it's going to fix the problem. So uh, this is pretty much the only solution that we have now. So we're gonna find out what's going on. Woo! Woo! We got plenty of silicone. Time to go crazy with it. Ready to get back, man. I'm not even gonna lie, I'm tired. The body is sore, man. I haven't worked like this in a long time, man. Straight, 12, 16 hour days, multiple days. I'm talking about physical. I work like this all the time, but not physically. Y'all don't know anything about that, man. Cut that off, man. I don't know nothing about that, man. You give y'all some young bucks, man. Don't know nothing about that. But yeah, man, I haven't worked like this physically, man. Probably for like maybe two years, a year and a half, maybe maybe about a year and a half. So my body's not used to it. Walking around, I mean, constantly walking around. You talking about 12, 16 hours, just constantly moving. Only time we stop is to grab something real quick to eat and then keep it pushing, man. And I'll be sleeping like a child. I'll be sleeping like a newborn baby, man, by the end of the night, man. I'm telling you. <laughs> 